Hi everyone, this is Borek. Today we will talk about Impact Mini Reflex Sight from Firefield. I got the red dot for today's film from the Firefield themselves. If you like them want to help me develop my channel, you can do it by symbolically buying me a virtual coffee. Link in the description. It has long been known that the red dots are useful equipment. If we are looking for a device that can be successfully used on both long replicas and a pistol, it is definitely worth considering Impact Mini Reflex Sight. In today's video we will tell you um, a little bit more about this red dot and which should help you decide whether or not you want to buy it. I will discuss its feature, take a closer look and finally give you some of my opinion about it. The red dot comes to us with several accessories. In the box we have everything we need to mount the device on the replica and run it. Impact Mini Reflex Sight is small, its length is less than 5 cm, width is 2.6 cm and height is up to 2.5 cm. The red dot is light, even though it is made mostly of metal, it seems durable and solidly made. Depending on our needs, we can mount it on low or high mounting or directly on appropriate mounting plate to the gun. By default we have a low Picatinny rail mount which we tighten with a screw on the side. The red dot is activated by pressing a small button on the side. There are two very small screws on the top and the sides for adjustment. The battery container is placed in the center of the red dot just below the glass. The red dot operates on CR1632 batteries. The aiming point is a straight red dot with a size of uh, 5 MOA. Adjusting the dot position is smooth without clicks. We can also adjust the brightness of the aiming point in 5 levels. We turn off the red dot by holding the switch. Impact Mini Reflex Sight is an open row profile good quality red dot. In my opinion, the best way to use it is to mount it on a pistol replica. However, that's just my opinion. If you want, just put it whenever you like it. I regret that the scribe red dot operates on CR1632 batteries. I personally would prefer slightly larger 2032 batteries which are more easily available. It's a pity that the red dot is mounted with an allen key. It would be nice if there was some kind of QD assembly. The red aiming dot is ok, but it would be ideal if we could switch to green color as well. A big advantage is durability. The manufacturer declares a shock resistance of up to 800 Gs. The set includes a lot of assemblies. In addition, we will also be able to adapt this red dot to Glock MOS plates or Smith & Wesser core standard. This red dot is very light and compact in size. More materials with this described red dot can be found also on my Instagram. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching my video.